Yo, what's going on? What's up? Today we're going to be doing another Reddit video because that's what I want to do, alright? Don't bother me. And also I'm going to be trying this for the first time today, so you already know it's going to be a pretty, um, pretty spicy video. Alright, so I was kind of cruising down Reddit and all of it was politics and I really could care less about all that. I don't want to get involved in that. So, yeah, I found this one. I thought it'd be pretty interesting to go through. This subreddit is called, Well That Sucks. I'm basically just gonna be looking at these unfortunate events that happen to these people. So yeah, let's get into it. First one that pops up. The lady at the courthouse neglected to tell me I was looking at the wrong camera. Yeah, that's awful, and that's on your license too, so it's like, I mean, she could have just retook the picture, but regardless, that's, that's pretty terrible. Saw this wedding photo in the dumpster. Guess it didn't go so well. Yeah, man, weddings. I mean, yeah. Do, do people still get married? I feel like that's such a, like a past generation thing, you know? Like, I feel like no one's getting married anymore for all the right reasons, because f that. Like, I don't know, I just don't understand, like, I, like, I get it, you wanna be with someone or whatever, but it just, it seems like so much work. I don't know, man. Right now, I'm like so up in the air. Like, part of me thinks like, oh yeah, you know, that, it could be fun to, you know, someday get married. Cause I guess it's like, it's so like built into us by now. Like we're, you know, that's what you do. You get married and you have kids or whatever. But yeah, I'm like, eh, do I really want to do that? I don't know. I like my, you know, my space, you know? I guess I was expecting a little bit more with that. It's decent though. All right, moving on. Neighbor didn't move his car on time. They just started construction around it. Yeah. I'm surprised they even did that, honestly. I'm surprised they didn't just get a tow truck in there and just take it out themselves. Saw on a uh, Instagram story. Come on, really? An, an Instagram story. Saw on an Instagram story. Someone's not had a good morning. Yeah, um, ugh. I don't know, like, what do you do in that situation, you know? You walk outside, you're going to work, you're, like, already not happy because it's, like, a, you know, a Tuesday morning or whatever. Go to walk outside, and it's, like, you know, just, oh, God, another day, going to the, and go to the office, you know? Then you walk outside, and you see your car is just completely destroyed because uh, someone placed a tree on it for some reason. It's got to be super annoying. Can't relate. Cat food got stuck perfectly in the sink. I'm working on prying it out currently. Magnet, okay? Just get a big magnet. Just take a magnet and just boom, done. Get it out. It'll come out in a second, you know? You don't have to waste time trying to get like a butter knife and pry it out. Nah, magnet. And if you don't have one of those, well, mm, that kind of sucks. Things like these are like the most annoying things ever because it's like really, like that would happen. Like last night, for example, it was nowhere near this, but it was just a similar well, kind of similar. I guess it was kind of similar situation happened to me. Um, I was leaving the gym and, you know, I was like fumbling my keys around and whatever. I was getting in the car and I don't know what, like I first somehow I dropped the key and it went right between the seat and I'm like, jeez, are you kidding me? So now I got to get out. It's raining, by the way. I got to get out. I'm like looking under the seat, shining my light because of course it's dark out. I just want to go home and I got to look for the key. It took like uh, maybe a minute. So it's really not that big of a deal, but like, come on, really? It's the worst when stuff goes down the seat, down the side of the seat and you can't reach it. Unreal. This is one of the most annoying things ever. The first day I wore my new tan pants. Yeah, like I got this white hoodie for Christmas a while ago and it's really nice, okay? I think I've worn it like maybe three times because I'm just terrified of getting anything on it because I know that even if you like, you don't even have to spill anything on you. Like, you could just lean up against a wall or something, and it'll have, like, you know, whatever. And then you get, like, a mark on it. Anything light colored. That's why I literally, I primarily just wear black all the time. Because it doesn't really matter. Try to avoid that altogether, just because, I like, that's that's just a nightmare. And you know you're never going to get the stain out. It doesn't matter if you use Tide or whatever. It's just not going to come out. It's not going to happen. Coke vendor knocked over eggs and left. First thing I see when I come in the morning. Yeah, man. Um, you know what I'd do in that situation if I walked into work and saw that? Just, you know, walk back to the thing, punch in my numbers, clock out, and go home. I can imagine them too, like, they go in there, and they, like, knock a bunch of shit over, and then they're like, oh, like, oh god, what do we do? Like, they're, like, scrambling to try to, ah, huh, that's funny, no pun intended. Ugh. And they're, like, trying to figure out what to do, and they're like, you know what, just leave, we didn't see it. Little did they know it's 2020 and you're probably on camera. 
Sweet, I found the AirPod I lost last night. Yeah, well that's what happens when you get AirPods. You know what? Here. You see, the one thing, I would like a pair of AirPods, okay? But it's just the fact that they're so overhyped and everyone's like, oh, you know, a rich kid check and they have their AirPods. It's like, bro, no, okay? This is what you need to get. These are amazing, okay? Beat Studio 3s. The only problem is they're really heavy. I hate how everyone's always flexing their stupid AirPods. It's like, like I get it was like kind of a meme at one point, but like, I don't even know why. Cause it's not even like, like people make it seem like they're so expensive, like as if they were like $600 or a thousand dollars. It's like, they're not, they're not even close to that. Like I just, I don't, I don't know why that bothered me for like the longest time that people were like, flexing that they'd have AirPods, it's like, congratulations, okay, you have a pair of headphones, like, no one cares, alright? Trying to make a quick trip, ah, trying to make a quick trip to the office to pick up some things, my key escaped from my fob. Yeah, those things are super annoying. Um, I've never had that exact key, a couple of my friends have had them, and you hit the button, and like, sometimes it just wouldn't flip out, because that's, that's the type of key, if you don't, if you're not familiar with it, because it's stupid, you hit that little button on the corner, and the key thing flips up, and sometimes, like, you know, they'd hit the button, and it just wouldn't move anywhere, so it's like, this thing's useless, because you can't, like, you need that part, obviously. One of my cars, like, you had to have the key fob, you didn't have to put it in anywhere, you just had to have it on you, um, and then the one time I was going down the road, and for some reason up on the dashboard, like I, I had my key on, I know I did, it was literally in my pocket. And I was going down the road and my car like said on the dashboard, it was like, um, like key fob missing or something. And I was like, it's immediately like peak anxiety. Cause I'm like, if I should like, what if my car just like shuts out? Like, you don't know, you know, especially cause the, the damn thing's in my pocket. So I'm like freaking out right now because I don't know what's about to happen. Like this could be a DEFCON 5 emergency. This could be a horrible tragedy just waiting to happen. And I just wasn't ready for it. Luckily nothing happened. Definitely super alarming. Wouldn't sell their lot so developers built around it. Yeah, no, I don't blame you. Who cares? That reminds me of the movie Up where he just like never moves and they build all these massive buildings around his house. Just drop the remote in a pot of moisturizer. Why? Like, what do you, first of all, how? Like, how? Like, usually they have the little nozzle and you push down on it and it's like, like, like it's a dispenser. How do you drop a TV <laughs> remote into that? I don't understand that. Unless it's like a huge jar, but like, again, like, how do you, this stuff is actually decent. I'm not gonna lie. It doesn't taste like anything, but I feel like it, it like, it wants to taste like something, but it doesn't. So, it's very, um, it's very confusing. I don't know. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> the hill I have to climb every day to get to the mail. Nah. Nope. Sell it. Sell the whole thing. Knock it down. Not dealing with that. If you still have hope in humanity, would the thief who stole my wheelbarrow please return it? Return the damn wheelbarrow, okay? Like, what are you doing? Why are you taking people's wheelbarrows? Like, come on. Let's, let's be better than this. It's 2020, okay? Let's stop. It doesn't, <laughs> it's not yours, okay? Give it back. All right, I think I'm gonna end it on this. Uh, I can't talk today, I don't know what's going on. I think I'm gonna end it here though. Um, ran 2.2 miles to get the wrong flavor of Arizona. First of all, how do you get the wrong, there's only one flavor of Arizona, okay? It's the green tea with ginseng or however it's pronounced. There's only one, okay? That's the only one you need. There's no other one that matters. Like, maybe the raspberry one, like, maybe, and maybe the original. If you were, like, seriously dehydrated and you, like, need this to, to continue living, then maybe you get the original one or, like, the raspberry one. But the, the green tea, it's just, it's superior in all ways. There's, there's nothing that even comes close. I don't even know, fruit punch? What are you, really? What are you doing? Please, rethink your life. I think that's it for this episode. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Uh, subscribe if you are not, okay? Listen, <laughs> come on, all right? Do it. You don't wanna miss out on any of these videos. Oh, also, if there's any subreddits that you guys want me to look through, please feel free to comment them down below. Let me know and maybe I'll take a look at them if they're good. Um, I'll see you later.